What's up, everybody? Hey, guys. Hey, uh, so, in honor of the release of the uh, long-awaited uh, Final Fantasy XV, um, I thought we'd play the a King's Tale. It was a pre-order bonus that you got if you pre-order through GameStop, which I did. Um, looks like it's a fun game, uh, so we're going to play it. So I hope you enjoy. I know it's kind of a... Uh, he hasn't played any Final Fantasy. Have you played any Final Fantasies? Yeah, I played the uh, MMO. We, we oh. played a lot. <laughs> yeah, I played okay. that one, and I watched my cousin play Final Fantasy VI. I didn't get to play it because he was older than me. Well, we'll change that. Um, so this is Noctis. I've certainly had my share of adventures, but none like the ones in this book. You can exaggerate or make it up as you go along. Just tell me something new. Poor kid. Keep getting told the same story. Very well then. It all started right here in Insomnia a long, long time ago. Wait, so this line's called Insomnia? Yeah. So then it's a... It's a... That's not very nice. Alright. So who are you? I'm guessing I'm Regis, his father at a young age. This is like a prequel story. Okay. I like the controls. Something wasn't quite right within the city. Were you under attack? Indeed we were, but not by Sochus. Wow, e Eos would... West Camp sent for me at this hour. Where is he? Anyway. <laughs> Kaboom! What was that? Oh shit, it's Ninja Samurai dude. He looks kind of like a hairless cat. Alright, so we got click strong, so okay. So just some basic attacks. Oh! That was pretty sweet. Bouncing back and forth mm -hmm. in Final Fantasy 15, that's called phasing. Okay. It's, it's really cool. Oh, man. Oh, wow. That's a really cool game. I've yet to actually play this game because I've been too obsessed with Final Fantasy. Yeah, I see a lot of people playing it on Twitch and a lot of YouTube videos on it, but I haven't seen many of these. So, hopefully you guys enjoy this for those who didn't uh, pre-order. A couple of my friends were saying that they did it. They're like, no, we didn't know you did that. Like, just read the internet, guys. Come on. Interweb. Like, literally, on uh, the Final Fantasy 15 webpage, they had, like, Every pre-order in the world, and like, what, what was the benefit? Like, no, I'm not jitting you. Yeah. So I'm, I'm assuming this was the best one. Uh, kind of. I mean, there's some cool. Like, what other ones were? Uh, just weapons and stuff like this. I mean, GameStop in the U.S. is the only one that has this game, which is really cool. I'm guessing this is just a tutorial. <laughs> oh wow. So is this? How does this fighting, uh, what am I trying to say? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Not bad, uh, The combat mechanics, how is this similar in any way? Or is it the same in the new game? It actually plays a lot like the new game. Um, the new, the new game is all about combos. And, uh, it, it's not your traditional Final Fantasy. I mean, if you're like me and grew up with turn-based RPGs, it's, it's not that. It's insane. Gotcha. So is this the first time they've done something like this besides, like, the MMO that they did? Um, well, Final Fantasy XIII was a little bit different. Like, you only controlled one character. You kind of told the other ones what to do, like a, okay. like a, a chain of events. But, uh, a bomb. Um, 
they've, they've had side games and stuff, like uh, there was a, the Final Fantasy Type HD. Uh, which it's kind of like, kind of like, I mean, I haven't played that one yet, but from what I understand, the, the side is kind of similar. Gotcha. But, uh, I don't really like to play that game. But no, not really. I mean, they've always had some type of element of like, like, it's like an action RPG or something. Like, this is like full on action. It's still got elements of an RPG, but it's it, it's it's really unique. I, I can't wait for you to play it. It's, it's it's different. So where would you rank this new one? Now I know you don't think I mean, I've only played about six hours into it. Yeah, um, I know you had that really made a dent into it. A super <laughs> long game, um, but as of right now, where would you rank it? Um, I would say. If I'm gonna rank my my favorite Final Fantasies, we got Final Fantasy VI is always gonna be number one for me. So. Uh, then I would go Final Fantasy VII, okay. uh, the nine, then mm, probably four. Okay. Then ten. So this doesn't crack the top five yet. Yeah. Okay. But I mean, I, I played those games so much. Right. Give you a little nostalgia. I would say. Right now, it's on the same page of Final Fantasy VIII, which I love Final Fantasy VIII, but it's not my absolute fa you know, it's Those aren't my favorite. Cool. Definitely, I like it so far more. I'm more captivated in it than I was with uh, Final Fantasy XII and Final Fantasy XIII 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 and Final I, I played Final Fantasy V and I really liked it. Um, the first one, you know, the first one's classic. It's got, if you grew up playing uh, RPGs like I did, you had to play it. Uh, I like these combos. But... I know, I'm really excited to get deeper into it. Man. So far, it's been a lot of fun. I really... Wasn't heartbroken last time when you said you couldn't record. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't think you would be. How about? I don't know if everyone has a problem that I have right now. But I have an immense amount of games to play. And no time to play them. Yeah, man, we tried to get you on Overwatch. I play. It. <laughs> it's not, the first person shooter not where my heart is. Hey, it's a MOBA. Okay. It's not your traditional. Not to offend anybody who loves Overwatch. I really enjoy hey, it. Hey, I got you, Overwatch guys. I, I enjoy it every time. But we played it for like six hours the other day. It was great. That's an average day for me. <laughs> and now, demons. I like how they spell demons. <laughs> demons. Dimes. So, is it really pronounced demons? That's, they got, they got they to say like throw that A in there? Demons. <laughs> it sounds like a southerner. Get one of them demons over here. Diamonds. Tell you what, boys, better watch out for them demons. <laughs> uh, in, the, in the Final Fantasy 15, uh, <coughs> whenever, like, if the night, if it goes to nighttime, mm -hmm. um, apparently demons come out. I haven't seen it yet because like, the, the game kind of advises you not to do it. Gotcha. And. I'm the type of person like, oh, I don't want to get, you know, raped in the game. So what? So is it kind of like a uh, a Fallout or a Skyrim where I have a place to sleep for a certain amount of time? Mm -hmm. Okay. You can sleep in cities. You can. Uh... Oh wow, that's cool. Mm -hmm. You sleep in cities, and there's certain points where you actually your characters will build camp. It's really, really cool, man. I'm a sucker for Florence and the Machine, and she did like a song for it, and it started like right when the game started. And it was, it's that Stand By Me song, you know? Stand by me. From like that old movie, you know? Oh, okay, okay. But, uh. I thought it was something that she did, and I'm like, I don't no, know. No, no offense to her, I just don't know. She covered it, and it, it's really good. But like, it fit perfect because it's like the car broke down, they're driving, and. They're having to push it and it starts playing it. And, like, and you're having to push the car in the game? Yeah. What? It's crazy, man. I didn't know Final Fantasy had those. 
Uh, they, they usually have some form of a vehicle. But, yeah, you have a car, like... Well, because I was always under the impression that it was set in more of a uh, ancient world where they did have that part and such. Some are, some aren't. Um, depends on which... They, they usually always have some form of an airship. Yeah, I'm talking, I'm not saying anything. Hey, you got to die, son. Yeah, you got some HP back. Give me some donuts. Oh, so do they do like Zelda, where they have all these games, but they're not in chronological order? Yeah, they have. They have nothing to do with each other. Oh, okay. So it's all just. So these characters here are not from any other one. Nah. Okay. Now they're good thing to ask you, brother. There's theories about it that like <laughs> say that. Some games, there are some that do have sequels, like 13 and 10 have sequels. Mm -hmm. uh, I, think, I think 12 had a prequel. But, uh. There, there's a theory that, uh. Final Fantasy 10 takes place in the same world that Final Fantasy, uh. 7 was. Mm -hmm. Like, it's a future version of Final Fantasy 7. Uh, but they've never came out and said that. I think one of the directors hinted towards it, but it's never been set in stone. Which they're kind of like, it's, uh, it's up to the imagination. Yeah. And, and if you read deeper, there's other theories of it. This, this one is this game, this game is this game, and... Um, and we'll have to play through Final Fantasy VI. Because I, I personally feel like uh, Six had the best story, characters, and overall just it's such a great. I've played that game so many times. Not to hate on Final Fantasy VII had a really good story, but man, Six, that true pinnacle. There's no stopping. I know, man. Regions is bad. <laughs> Regis Philbin. <laughs> <laughs> it's a young Regis Philbin. Who wants to be a millionaire? Is <clears throat> <clears throat> that everybody? Yep. Cyclone! Shit! Cyclone! Shit! Heavy strike! <laughs> Really cool Final Fantasy 15 is the main character Noctis. He can control. He can use like many different weapons. Mm -hmm. Like, so you have four party members and you control Noctis. And so the other three guys, one is like kind of like a heavy, heavy arm type guy. So he has a big S sword. Mm -hmm. One has daggers. One has a gun. Um, but Noctis, he can use all the weapons. So that guy. No, not that this, So that's that's Noctis as a child. That's his father, the king. So Noctis is the prince. So the game follows Noctis. Hmm. All right, hole R one. So, okay. Charge magic. Oh, I want to see this. I always like to magic in games. Oh, that's that, cool. that's awesome. That's a pretty cool game, man. It's like Ice Mage. I wonder how long it is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Seeing as it's a prequel, I couldn't imagine it's too long, and you haven't really stopped. You just kept going. Uh, oh. You're so cute! <laughs> Dead one side. <laughs> <laughs> so is that a joke? Did Dad take that as a joke? <laughs> You're so cool. <laughs> maybe maybe he's like modest, you know. He's like, oh yeah, I guess. I guess yeah. But he could be, he, you know, he's reading the story, telling the story, so he could just be like, yeah, I was like fucking just knocking shit up, yeah. being a badass. <laughs> this is his embellishment. Yeah. Not just like, yeah, dad, you so cool. Well, you know what's gonna happen, right? The kid told his dad it's okay to embellish. And as soon as he hears this story, he's gonna go to all school and be like, Yo! My dad did lizards and icicles came out of the ground! <laughs> I can't do the icicles anymore. I'm gonna attack and beat up your dad. 
Uh, looks like you have like a little magic at the bottom corner. A little meter. Yeah, I was pressing it, but I don't know. I haven't had to get my ass kicked some more. Dead, dead, dead. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, you don't want to die on first level. Am I still on first level? I, I, are there levels? Nice magic. Oh, okay, so I had to build back up by the MP. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's what I was saying. That was the bottom corner. Yeah. I, I think I just kind of spammed it. <laughs> there, there was a lot of ice that was coming out of the ground. Yeah. Looks like they're getting harder. That reminds me of Red Skull. Yeah. Here's <laughs> five Captain America. So yeah, um, it's a pretty fun game. Um, I kind of want to just... I do a whole series on it. Uh, that would be kind of cool. Might as well. If, it's, if, it's not, if it just becomes competitive, or whatever, you know, whatever. I couldn't imagine they put a whole lot into the game. It's only a pre order for GameStop. But... You never know, man. Well, you did say, like, it's only up to. In the US, it was only at GameStop. Yeah, I think, I think other. Like, a GameStop equivalents. Uh, Game Wall or whatever it's called over in Europe, they did that too. Things are heating up. I'm about to find Westcom now. I guess we'll do that on the next episode.